What's up, everybody? This is the Classic Tycoon here, and we're back for episode 32 of the Million Dollar Mission Let's Play series. Um, this clip is going really slow right now because I just wanted to talk to you guys for a second. Um, in the last episode, we built this twister roller coaster here, and um, yeah, it, it's uh, it's got too high of an extreme of an of a intensity rating so i've got to do some fixes to it so um, i'm going to do that right now and just speed through that and um, i'm rebuilding like a bunch of the roller coaster so i'll have you guys watch me do that after that's done happening i'll come back and i'll kind of talk through the test again and make sure that everything works there and then we'll be back okay so i'm going to play some music again for you guys today and then um yeah, go ahead and enjoy watching the rest of this roller coaster build. We'll come back and check out the test in a second. Thanks, guys. All right, guys, I'm back, and um, we're almost done uh, building this thing again, so we're going to finish this up real quick, um, see if we can add a couple things to make it a little bit more interesting. I was a little bit disappointed the way that that turned out um, with the excitement rating, especially since it's such a huge build, you know, um, but we're going to throw in a couple loops here, hopefully that roller coaster is not going too fast at this point you can see some of the changes um, that I had to make in order to make this thing um, slow it down at this point so um, again guys I want I want to let you or I want to know your feedback on the music and if you guys like that sort of thing um, but uh, I appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me lately and I um, my subscriber growth has sort of stopped for a moment. I'm not, I mean, I'm 
at this moment, at the moment of recording, I'm at 32, and I have been for the past about a week. And that's pretty low, obviously. That's a really... I'm not... I haven't been discovered yet, really, right? Um, so I'm hoping that that's going to change. And, you know, I'm just going to be... I'm going to keep committing to making these videos. Um, I do it for fun anyways. And I've really enjoyed um, helping out those who I've helped out so far. So... But obviously, I would love to um, become more successful um, as a YouTuber. So, anyways, guys, let's um, let's watch this thing again. It's I mean, it's pretty similar to the first time or the last episode when we watched it, right? But we changed some of the roller coaster, and um, hopefully, this thing works out a little bit better this time. So this is kind of the point where I made the most changes, right? I kind of added this in here, and the roller coaster is going a little slower at that point, but this is the main thing is adding these brakes and the block brakes right here. So that'll slow it down quite a bit. I'm a little bit worried about that um, corkscrew that I put in back there because corkscrews can be some of the causes of the worst vertical Gs in the game. So let's see how this test went. Nothing in the red. That's good. But our intensity is still above a 10. Um, so I'm going to go through and take out that corkscrew and see if that does anything. Um, it could be that there's just too many inversions. I mean, there's not that many inversions, but it, it's just a huge roller coaster, and so many variables go into it, and so many things can go wrong. Um, so that's unfortunate that, how that worked out. But let's watch this thing. I know we've we've been watching this thing a ton. Um, but let's watch it one more time. I love I like watching roller coasters a lot. Anyways, um, watch this one more time in real time. And then we'll see, I don't know, if it doesn't work out this time, we might just delete it. Um, Alright, but anyways, like I was saying before, um, I really do appreciate you guys and the ones who have been watching me um, just diligently and been giving me feedback and all that you guys have been a huge help and i really appreciate it and i'm i'm hoping I'm hoping that this thing becomes a little bit more successful but you know the problem is i think the main thing is you know i'm doing <laughs> i'm doing videos on roller coaster tycoon classic in 2017 right and that's there's not much of a wide audience um for this sort of thing, I don't think, you know, it's one thing to be a video gamer, um, or a, a video gamer, just a gamer, and, you know, playing Call of Duty and uploading Minecraft videos and that sort of thing, you know, um, and it's a lot easier, uh, not to take away the success of those big YouTubers that do that sort of thing, and there's, there's some really awesome ones. But I, I feel like the audience is so wide for something like that. It's going to be a lot, not a lot, but it's going to be, you know, you're, you're more likely to have success. There's more people that are going to be looking for that sort of thing than, you know, RCT Classic, uh, a spinoff of Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 and Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. You know, this is just such a, a small audience. So, you know, I love the game. That's why I'm doing it. As we look at our excitement and intensity rating, are now in the black, 8.09. That's a pretty good excitement rating. Not the best in the park, um, but it's a pretty sweet roller coaster. So let's rename this thing. Let's recolor it. Let's uh, 
build our pathways and get this thing opened up for the guests here. I'm the reason why I'm choosing the white and the blue colors is because of the snow at the top of the mountain. I think it matches that pretty well. And um yeah, let me know what you guys thought about this roller coaster. I had some fun building it. Building it. it took me quite a long time, but notice our money. Okay, nine hundred fifty thousand dollars. We at the start of this thing, um, we had eight hundred fifty thousand dollars at the start of building this roller coaster, and um, we were still in September or something like that. So, guys, we are extremely close. I think in the next episode, we'll probably make that million dollar goal and then our million dollar mission will be complete and um i don't know what i'll do for the final episode if i'll just kind of you know recap the whole thing and go through and and just show off the park um or what we'll do um i don't know we'll figure it out let's put in a restroom and cash machine over here now that we're in the outskirts of the park and uh, just see what the guests are up to, and then we'll wrap up this video. So, still a bit of a ghost town over on this side of the map. Um, we lost some guests during that because I wasn't running ad campaigns. Well, I was trying to as much as I could during the building of this thing, but I just lost track of it at one point, and uh, we lost some guests, but... Hopefully, now that this thing is open, those guests will be on the rise. And um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I did put a f on ride photo section for this thing. So it's going to be generating some really good money. Even though at this point, <laughs> you know, we're making some bank. So, um, yeah, the guest flow is coming in. There, There's more of them coming in. As you can see, the guests are still all heading for Hell Train. That's been like the story since I built that ride. Um, but it's because the excitement rating on that thing is like a 9.3 or something like that. So it's a pretty good roller coaster. Um, these ones that are coming in and heading for the Mountainside Monster are probably just entering the park and seeing it through the ad campaign. But yeah um that's it guys so i'll see you guys the next episode will most likely be the finale i don't know what i'm gonna do yet um maybe i'll just build one last roller coaster um i don't know that mountainside roller coaster is a pretty good one to end on i think but we'll see um thanks for watching guys i really appreciate you Please um, let me know what you thought. Leave me a like if you liked the episode. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in the final episode.